No. My name is Timothy Trespass, and I'm a human being who has found himself victim of what is called targeting. Uh, been given disease through parasites and bio weaponized nanotechnology and horrible parasites and microwave weapons and as you can see when I look at myself I, I almost cry <laughs> it's really um, I've just woken up <clears throat> I'm trying to figure out which side of my face is more fucked up which one is the one that used to be me is no longer that. Maybe this side is more or less fucked up. As you can see, uh, I woke up today and everything is crooked. Uh, my teeth are all going like this this morning, which means I've been sleeping I don't know. There's so much swelling in my body, um, as well as damage, and it almost, well, it is, it's clear that the bones, the structure of the face can be slightly malleable now, <laughs> depending on how I sleep. Um, the neurological damage is profound, <laughs> although I'm still functioning, so it can't be that bad, but you'd be surprised. The brain is somewhat neuroplastic, <laughs> I guess. Uh, yes, there's a more reason for all those morning exercises. Try to put your bone structure back in place. Um, ooh, unfortunately, it doesn't uh, always work. The reason I wanted to make this video actually was because today um, I'm going to take my first and hopefully last uh, stool sample. Uh, that, as you probably know, isn't a sample of the stool that I sit on. This is where I burn myself. Uh, I do that all the time. It's like a joke. Anyway, it's not the kind of stool you sit on, although you do sit to relieve oneself of this kind of stool. So, the hospital has given me in their great capacity to assist one has given me some wonderful gloves and some wonderful little vials. Now, those of you who have made a, a stool sample for your doctor before know all this, but in this vial is uh, some liquid formaldehyde, pH buffered to neutral, uh, and thoughtfully, this was made in Italy, by the way, uh, Milano, Vite Corse. And the people in Milano were very nice. They gave us a little spoon inside of here. And not just a spoon, a spoon with like a sharp fork on the end. And I thought that was very insightful. So now I have my stool sample, uh, sampling equipment ready. And if you'll excuse me, I'm going to perform the ever so unpleasant duty of collecting it. Um, the reason we're going to do this, I guess, is so they can test it and see what parasites or, you know, cancer or... I don't know what they do with it. Maybe they just look at it and go, ha 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 ha, we made them. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, um, this one is nice also because it has a big label on it. So you're not forced to, like, inspect your stool the entire time. Unfortunately... Well, fortunately, I don't know. I, I like to inspect everything that comes out of me. It's become a habit now. Um, although I try not to do too much stool inspecting. Um, I think I said that word enough now, and the humor is worn off. So, <clears throat> if you'll excuse me. 
I'm going to thank God I'm laughing because otherwise. Oh my God. Yeah. Thanks for watching and 